Hi, I'm Jess, welcome to my channel. So this edition, we wanted to talk loungewear. I am a loungewear obsessive. I love, 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 love finding beautiful loungewear to wear, from pajamas to slouchy joggers for just wearing around the house. I think it's this time of year that I just kind of, you want to get cozy, you want to put the candles on, but finding luxurious loungewear is always quite hard, I think. So if anyone feels like an expert of loungewear, it's me because I have an awful lot of it and I scour the internet for the best bits all the time. So this is our edition of our favorite loungewear we found for autumn winter 80. So first up is this jogging set that I'm wearing from a brand called APC that I found on Net-A-Porter. This is totally my cup of tea. It's that really thick, heavy, gorgeously soft cotton. So it feels like really high quality. The jumper, obviously just really simple. I love gray and white together. So if I'm going for a sort of sweat jumper that I wanna wear around the house, I'd always probably pick gray and white. I love those two tones. And it's kind of like the gray marl, so it just makes it a little bit softer than a, a block gray, I suppose. So yeah, really, really cozy. I've gone for a medium. Um, probably actually couldn't get away with a small, which I'm imagining a small would be eight to 10 which is probably my true to size on the top, but I bought the medium because I knew I don't, you know, it's loungewear. I want to be really cozy and comfy. Definitely don't want it feeling tight. And there's not a huge amount of room in there to go much smaller anyway, for me, for my perfect kind of fit. So joggers, again, I went for a size medium. Could have possibly gone a size smaller if you want it more streamlined. So nice deep pockets there and a tie waist. I tend to wear these type of joggers quite low, so I've literally put that kind of on my hip bone. I don't like them looking too high. I think it, it, it's not very flattering, personally. So even though the crotch is really low here, personally, that's kind of how I like to wear them. I like them sort of slouchy for around the house. I've just paired it with a pair of socks that I got from a brand called Genevieve Sweeney, who's a gorgeous girl who makes her own collection of knitwear. Um, we did meet on Instagram, but then we met in person and she's beautiful and she creates this lovely collection and I can't sing her praises enough. So we've got a couple of her pieces to show you throughout this video. Um, but do know it's from a genuine love of what she creates um, because she's, she's making some really lovely pieces. So yeah, I've got her sparkly number Merino socks on, which I'll show you in a sec. Um, so just very chilled. Obviously, it's nice to have something in cotton in my wardrobe for loungewear. You kind of think of loungewear, you think of knitwear, but it doesn't have to be just knits. You can go for the Jersey Terry cottons because um, it's actually really cozy and comfortable as well as the knits. So this next look, I went to H&M and essentially found a basic white t-shirt that I loved. And I don't know about you, but finding the perfect white tee is a challenge in itself, but like finding the perfect loungewear. Um, so this one obviously is 100% cotton. It's very basic, there's not much detail to it, but I think that's why I like it because it's very simple. I've just turned the sleeves up, ironed those in place. The t-shirt, I can't remember off the top of my head, but I think it was like eight, nine pounds, so really reasonable. And obviously you could wear that to bed, etc. if you wanted to. And then the joggers are described as probably a, a pink mull. They say mull when they mean there's another grain of colour sort of going through it. So they've kind of got a bit of grey through the, the vein of the pink, which is actually really nice. It just makes an item look slightly more expensive than it was because they've got another colour running through it, a bit more detail, I suppose. So simple tie waist. I, again, sized up with both of these. I probably could have worn my normal size because there's definitely room in both the top and the joggers, probably just by your own size. I think there's enough room there to still feel slouchy. Um, so I might switch it actually just for my correct size. But yeah, really cozy, this sort of go in at the hem around your ankles. It's very comfortable, it's very chilled. I feel really cozy. Um, yeah, I think that's a nice look from H&M. So we couldn't do a loungewear haul without at least featuring one item from The White Company. I love The White Company, actually. I love their entire collection from 
the candles, diffusers, the homeware and the clothing as well. I think they've got everything spot on. In fact, the children's wear as well, I buy that an awful lot. Um, they're PJs for kids. Um, Father Christmas always manages to go to the white company uh, for kids' PJs. So this is their Hydro Cotton Dressing Gown. They're obviously really famous for their dressing gowns, uh, but with good reason, to be honest, because the quality is amazing. They last so well. I mean, I've had a brown one for years and it's probably only just died a death and finally I needed to change it. So yeah, so this is the Hydro Cotton, which apparently it says that it's a different technology to how they stitch it, which means it feels fluffier and thicker and it does feel really fluff, fluff, fluff. <laughs> it feels really fluffy and it does feel really thick, so it must work. So we've got a nice deep hood here, which I can show you, that's what that looks like up. Uh, which is lovely and cosy for autumn winter. I love that feeling of going in a nice hot bath through autumn winter and then putting on sort of fresh crisp pajamas and a lovely snuggly dressing gown. You can see there's a running theme here how obsessed I am with this whole loungewear thing. But it's that's what it's all about, it's the senses. So you have a lovely bath in beautiful essential oils and you've got your candles going fresh sort of crisp pyjamas and then getting your nice thick dressing gown on and getting into crisp sheets. I think it's all about encompassing that feeling of autumn winter and making you feel nice and cosy. So White Company, always a winner for lots of different things, but for this episode, absolutely choose their dressing gown. So this next set came from Topshop and to be honest this one really surprised me in terms of the quality because it's beautiful. It feels a lot more expensive than it actually was. So the top itself was £22 I think and same for the trousers. And in actual fact the cotton here is beautiful, it's quite thick, it's lined in like a fleece, it feels beautifully soft and it's really really comfortable. So for £44 I've got a whole set that I'd wear as loungewear. Through winter, I'd probably wear it as pajamas and wear it to bed as well, because it's freezing here in England. And then equally, I'd feel comfortable enough to wear this out as well. I mean, not out, out going for a drink, but just out in the daytime with a coat on. So in terms of value for money for £44, I think that's brilliant. I mean, the top, again, um, I've oversized, so I went for a medium which is fine, that fits nice. You could go smaller if you wanted it a bit tighter and a different look, but I want it cosy and comfy, so I'm fine with that size. Just a nice sort of wide hem here that just sits quite nicely over your waistband. And then the trousers, again, have got quite a deep um, waistband here, which is quite nice, it's quite flattering when trousers do that. And deep pockets again, gathered in at the ankle, which I think is quite a nice look on joggers. On the pictures on Topshop, I don't think it sold it as well as the quality that it is when you see it in person and hopefully that's kind of translating on screen as well because it's so comfortable it feels like a really nice cotton the fleece against your skin is beautiful and it's really really comfy as well so all in all Topshop have done a brilliant job with that one I think Next up is this beautiful 100% silk pair of pyjamas that I absolutely love. I think they're stunning. It's a brand called Violet and Wren, which I discovered on Instagram actually. And her collection is amazing. I mean, she's got night dresses and different prints. I think they do all the prints themselves. So this one I chose is obviously the botanical print, but I thought that tone of green was beautiful. Very different to anything else I'd seen and probably a bit away from my usual sticking to my pinks and greys of loungewear and just something a bit different. So it's 100% silk, which feels it completely. It's absolutely beautiful, so soft. So although my size, I would probably go for a small, I've sized up again and gone for the medium in these. And I think that's just about right. So the, the sleeves are probably a little bit long, but I like that. Fits nicely on the shoulders and the length just comes just after the hip bone. Trousers, simple elasticated waist with a tie there as well. So obviously you've got buttons all the way down at the front and they've just trimmed all the edges with like a soft pink, which I think is really nice because it just brings in the pink of the flowers here. Just a nice contrast. 
and just really different to anything else I'd seen. They're really baggy, really slouchy, um, and that's just how I'd like them, to be honest. I don't like pyjamas with short legs. I think it just, just doesn't look good. It's not a good look. Um, so nice and slouchy and long suits me perfectly. This is a beautiful set, and I definitely recommend you going and having a look on her website. So this next look came from H&M again, and I saw the color of the dress again, just fell in love with it. I thought it was absolutely beautiful. It's 100% linen, which I thought was a nice alternative for um, a dressing gown for autumn, winter 18. Um, you might not live in England. It might be fine weather throughout winter where you are, but you just need a bit of coverage. And equally, I'd probably use this all the way through summer as well, to be honest with you. So it's just a really nice, relaxed fit, sort of slightly Japanese kind of shaping, I think, as well. Um, and then you've just got a simple tie here around the waistband. So I think for at home, as a piece of loungewear, in that colour, it feels quite chic, feels quite elegant, um, but equally very comfortable as well, again. They've got a couple of the linen dressing gowns, actually, in a few different colours, sort of like a soft pink and a grey, and maybe a white as well, actually. But I went with this colour because I thought it was just something a bit different, and I've probably got more than enough grey to last a lifetime. So just to go on top of whatever nighty or PJs or t-shirt and joggers that you're wearing underneath, I think that's a beautiful colour. So for this next look, we've gone to Genevieve Sweeney with this pure landswell grey sweater, which I absolutely love. I love the colour of it. It's beautifully soft. And it's just got this kind of open detail here at the side, which I think is really nice, just makes it a little bit more interesting. Now, obviously this sort of sweater you could wear out and wear for work and wear for loads of different occasions. But I just wanted to show you what this kind of thing would look like as loungewear, because this is often the sort of thing I love. You kind of have a lovely, beautiful knit on the top and then just some simple joggers on the bottom. And I think one, those tones work really nicely together. I think pink and gray is beautiful but also the textures, so simple cotton joggers, don't have to spend a fortune, and then just a gorgeous chunky knit on top, I think is a really lovely look. So yeah, do have a look at her website. She obviously specializes in knitwear, but she has everything on there from merino and cashmere and lambswool. And then she does this thing as well, where you can have a sock subscription and have a pair of socks arrives each month, which I thought was quite cute. So yeah, I've just worn the sweater with the pink joggers again that came from H&M. And I think it just creates a really chic, but very relaxed and very snuggled look for autumn winter in loungewear. So last but not least, we've gone to So Souk with this beautiful 100% cotton sort of Aztec looking pajama set. Now it's very comfy, really cozy. I've gone a size bigger as I often do, certainly with loungewear. Um, but I think when you're buying these sort of shirt type pyjama tops, they can have a tendency to come up a bit small. So I would always go up a size on, on lots of different brands, not just this one. So yeah, so I've got the medium. Um, it's got a lovely stitch detail down the front. The print I think is gorgeous. I love this color. Um, they're quite wrinkled because I literally wore them last night in bed. So yeah, I think 100% cotton as a pair of pyjamas is perfect. It's so comfortable, it's really breathable, obviously, as you may get hotter throughout the night. Trousers, just simple, elasticated waistband with a tie there as well. Nice wide leg, fits beautifully, love the print, really comfortable, love this one. So as ever, thank you so much for watching. I do hope you liked this edition. Um, if you've tuned in for the first time, I'm not always wearing my pyjamas on screen. We do talk about fashion in most of our episodes, um, but I really wanted to show you some of my favorite loungewear pieces because I'm obsessed with loungewear. So hopefully that came across and hopefully you liked the pieces we found. Don't forget to find us on Instagram at Fashion and Style Edit, and you can also visit our website, fashionstyleedit.com. We'll see you next time.